All right, it's Shalom on my account. First and foremost, I to give all praises to Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai, by Hashem Rekak Wadash, the bonds, the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, and we are the Hebrew Israelites, which consists of the Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, Simul Indians, West Indians, and Haitians. And according to the Holy Scriptures, we're God's chosen people. Shalom to all you beloved brethren out there, push his knowledge and sincerity and truth. Shalom to the few sisters, and shalom to Israelite foreigners who are scattered abroad. And what you're looking at is a true depiction of one you're going to be called Jesus Christ, whose real name in the Hebrew is Yahweh Shai. And what you're looking at is a true depiction of the one you're going to be called God, the one you're going to be called Jehovah, whose real name in the Hebrew is Yahweh. When you call upon the Most High and His Son, you must say Yahweh Bahashim. Yahweh Shai, Yahweh means He to be or He His. Bahashim means in the name, and Yahweh Shai means He delivers. Our Lord and Savior is coming to deliver the elect. Of the nation of Israel from the destruction of modern day Babylon, aka America. I want to say, Brakate Yahweh, Brakate Yahweh Shai, Brakate Yahweh, Brakate Yahweh Shai, and the body Yahweh by Shim Yahweh Shai for another blessed day. The body Yahweh by Shim Yahweh Shai for this opportunity is 100% truth. And the body Yahweh by Shim Yahweh Shai for the apostles and elders and all you beloved brethren out there push his knowledge and sincerity and truth. Lord, one to the end. All right, hey, Shalom, one brothers. Um, Pretty much, I want to go over this word, a temptation here, dealing with the Lord's Prayer. Because if you don't know how to pray, this is the Lord's Prayer. Um, pretty much Matthew chapter 6, um, when when Yahweh Shai is telling the disciples, and pretty much us how to pray. One of the words that stood out for me is the word temptation. I'm going to start off in Matthew 6 and 5, and when thou prayest, thou shalt not be as the hypocrites are for they love to pray standing in the synagogues in the corner of the streets that they may be seen of men verily I say unto you that ye have that they have their reward but thou when but thou when thou prayest enter into thy closet and when thou hast shut thy door pray to thy father which is in secret it's between you Yahweh by Shem Shai and thy father which seed in secret shall reward thee openly. So this is not I hear playing praying for a bunch of riches and all that stuff. Because you know, this is not the, the riches of this world is not real riches. Okay. So when you go down to verse um 13, you know, it says, Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is thy kingdom and power and glory forever. So when you go into the word temptation, what I'm trying to get to because that great temptation is coming, the hour of temptation. So when you go into that word there, let Esau say it. Strong's G, 3986, Pairasmas. Pairasmas. Hold on for a second. Right, so getting back to this word, I had to do something for my job real quick. Let's go over it again. Strong's G, 3986, Pairas Right, so when you go into the outline, the outline of biblical usage, it says an experiment, an attempt, a trial proving, a trial proving the trial made of you by many, by my bodily conditions. Brothers dealing with bodily conditions in, in this uh in their trials man all right since conditions serve as to test the love of the galatians towards paul so that that's that's part of the test of our love to the most high because the galatians were uh, the israelites of galatia were israel i mean <laughs> the people of uh, of galatia were israelites excuse me it says the trial of of a man's fidelity which means faith integrity virtue constancy an enticement to sin. And what is sin? Transgressions against the laws. Temptation. Whether arising from the desires or from the outward circumstances. Your desire starts in your mind. Then you deal with the out outward circumstances of a lot of our people that made it in the world. They sold their souls. An internal temptation to, to sin. Dealing with your, 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 um, your mind and stuff like that. Okay? It goes on to the um, dealing with the temptation Yahweh Shai to deal with, with the spiritual demon Satan. It says of the condition of things or a mental state by which we are enticed to sin or to lapse 
from the faith and the holiness. You understand? It says adversity, affliction, trouble sent by who? God and serving to test or prove one character, faith and holiness. Okay? And it comes in many shapes and forms. Come through your, your woman. Jake's like the my woman, my them motherfuckers are evil, bro. Them them bitches were oh, oh them these women were naggy, were naggy, were naggy. They said, okay, honey. You understand? A lot of you Jakes be lying. Stop fronting, bro. They're very dangerous. So you it goes like that with your woman, uh, family members, people in the world, yourself, your, 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 your internal thoughts. Many, many different aspects, man. You know, the Lord might, might, you know, like what Apostle Paul always say, you know how to be a base, not be a bound. He might, you know, bring you down to a lower state. You might not be making a lot of money. You might have to live with people. You, you might, shit, man, go through a lot of things. It's, it's a trial of your faith. So when it says, lead us not into temptation, but deliver us into evil. I mean, deliver us from evil. All right? Let's, let's get it. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine, for thine is the kingdom and power and glory forever. So it all, it all goes back to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. So the main point of me bringing out this lesson, bear with me one second, is that hour of temptation. Because you go into that word there, you, the same, it says G3986, and you got different precepts. Um, that links up with that. So now you know, get to understand our definition. Is uh, First Corinthians ten and thirteen. There had no temptation taking you, but such as is common to men. Everything you're dealing with in this life, everybody else is dealing with it. Financial situations, paycheck to paycheck, marital problems. Now we're in a society where they're trying to indoctrinate our children on a high level. It's fucking crazy. You understand what I'm saying? You're not getting getting no respect here in this world, no matter what the fuck you do. You understand what I'm saying? These women have authority and rule rulership over you. Does that that means you put a coward out and coward out? No, you you in a fight, you in a war. Stay in your ground, especially us being men, Lord willing, men of the Lord. You are here grinding. You getting up every fucking day working. You handling your business best of your ability. You paying the bills. Ain't none of us perfect. You gotta remember, man. We we all coming from slavery. Broken homes and all that crazy shit. So we got baggages with us. Ain't nobody gonna tell me fucking shit, except except the, our, our teachers, the apostles, and brothers, man. Ain't no woman gonna tell me shit if I'm handling my business to the best of my ability. And that's how I feel, and that's how I roll, brothers. And, I, and I'm living it. And I and we're the most responsible people in the world, man. I got a little morning rant. All right, the you know, most I as as is, is endowed us with this truth. And you know, we're being highly responsible with it. You understand what I'm saying? We are not in power, man. These, these women are fickle. They don't, they don't tell me shit about none of these women, man. And that's respectfully speaking. Okay? So we doing what the hell we got to do. Brothers, that, brothers, you have children. Handle your business, man. You got children out here. Handle your business, brothers. Don't forsake your children. Especially if you have a way to see them, man. Or be with them, whatever the fuck. Fuck that. You know, have 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 some strong influence in your seeds' lives, man. It is extremely because that, that we're here to break that cycle. Lord willing, you put out that number. The most side is going to use the hundred and forty-four thousand, which are men, the elect, to break that them curses, man. To 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 the most side going to use to to rebuild our nation. So whatever you're dealing with. It's common to every man out here, okay? What what is what is a heavier portion? We know the truth. So 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 that's the, that's the, that's the load right there. Like, damn man, nobody else could comprehend this but the elect. But God is is faithful, who will not suffer you to be tempted above he are able. So whatever you're going through, you're able to deal with it. But will, but will with temptation. The same word also make a way to escape. He may be able to bear it, man. All right? So we're, we're fucking soldiers. All right? So you got the other part of it. You got 1 Timothy 6 and 9. 
But they that will be rich of this world, man, fall into temptation. They're given over to what, what the definition said. Pull it up real quick. The same thing. Pure Rosmos. All right? Where it says, they're, 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 they have been... They have um, been given over to, to, to Satan. All right? Their, their mental state has been broken. They sold out. They have rebelled against God. They took an oath. They did all types of heinous things. These people of this world, you see, that's been, is being pushed in your face as, as some, as some um, desirous beings. A bunch of vile creatures. Motherfucker. Yo, you ain't, we ain't no weak motherfuckers, brothers. I might tell you shit. Especially a bitch. You ain't weak. Ain't no false brethren. And you know, you don't tell me, yo. Another level now, man. All crazy y'all by Shimmy Awashire. Okay? Let your family members talk crazy. Fuck these people, man. You on the front lines every day. Or whatever. Whenever you go out. You, we got the truth, man. Okay? Tell me shit. God damn it. <laughs> Please excuse me, brothers. Like, for real, man. Brothers, we got the truth. We got the truth, man. 100%. 100%, man. We, we, Israelites, should, we all should be dead, bros. There's a war against men out here, and we, we're, we're standing up. Standing up for our manhood. Trust these fucking people. Trust your how about shimmy I was shy. And the men he the men he got set up for you, man. Straight up. This shit about this shit about to change, man. And that hour from temptation, you about to see some shit. So a lot of these 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 jakes you see in the world, they got caught up in a snare into many foolish and hurtful lusts, which drowned men in destruction and perdition. Lord, and give us over that, over to that, brothers. Okay? Then you got James 1 and 12. Blessed is the man that endure it temptation. You're getting harder. You're not getting weaker. You're getting stronger. I could be going to jujitsu. Man, some of these higher belts, like, fuck, man. They be like, you all right? I was like, I'm getting stronger. That's how I feel. That, that's, that's the same thing. When when you when the Lord is trying you on different levels, man. You're an Israelite, man. You're an Israelite male, bro. This shit, this shit right here, man. Jake in the way. This shit right here ain't gonna last long, man. For when he has tried, he shall receive the crown of life. Which the Lord have promised to them that love him. We love the Lord, man. We we brothers having visions and dreams about like, yo. It's real, man. This ain't no play play thing. Give a fuck what motherfucker to say, man. I don't give a fuck what your woman say. Give a fuck what co-worker say. You supposed to give a fuck, man. That's how I feel, man. I don't give a fuck, yo. Motherfuckers gonna have to stand on this shit real soon, son. So a lot of shit we've been through. You've been motherfuckers cast you away, talking crazy. They push you to the side. You by yourself. Man, brother, we're gonna be by ourselves in this shit, a lot of us, man. Some brothers gonna lose their life for this thing, man. Fuck you mean, bro. It's, it's, going, it's about to go down in this motherfucker, man. And people, all these motherfuckers gonna be put to shame. And this bitch. So I don't want to keep ranting. You know, I'm pumped up this morning, man. I woke up this morning. Baby mother want to talk crazy. I had a dick in her ass, bitch. Or listen, bitch. Fuck are you talking to? Motherfucker. Fuck out of here, yo. These American hoes are done. All you motherfuckers, man. Sometimes you got to get on people like that, you know. Motherfucker. The hell up out of here, man. Revelation 3 and 10, because thou hast kept the word of my patience, I always will keep thee from the hour of temptation, which shall come upon the world to try them that dwell upon the earth. So it's coming, brothers. So everything we've been through, all oh, it's, about, it's about to be, Jake said game time, it's about to be on in this motherfucker, man. Then shall be known who is the Lord chosen. All right? Then shall be known, man. The Lord willing I am, man. Lord, where the rest of you brothers are, you know, from the apostles and on down, man. Somebody got to be of it. Somebody got to stand for truth. 
Somebody got to stand for Yahweh by Shimei. I will shout no matter what. Lord, Lord, about to get you. All you, most sides not mock. You see what the Lord doing to the dude, Mr. Brother Polite? The rest of you fools. The Lord is getting, you know You ain't seen shit. Jake want to hope, man. The Lord about to bring it, brother. So bless our E, us brothers, in our temptations, brothers, with your bodily ailments, whatever you're going through, brothers. It's almost that time, brothers. It's almost that fucking time, brothers. Shalom.